So first experiment is just while you're standing there, could you please think about, imagine some hard or dispiriting thing that you must accomplish in the next week? Something that you don't really want to do, like, you know, going to the dentist, something like that. Mm -hmm. So while you're imagining that thing, then you just feel what your standing is like. For the folks at home, you can walk around if you want to. We will not let Cynthia do this because she might walk off the camera and we could not admire her technique. And then let it go. The first experiment is if we power pose and add the Feldenkrais scan, what happens? So can you please stand with your feet apart, hands on your hips, elbows out to the sides, and whatever other thing you want to do, and you just stand there. Now, again, the power pose goes on for two minutes. And during these two minutes, could you please attend to, as I said before, your feet? Would you say that you're more on your heels or are you more towards the balls of your feet? Are you more towards the outsides of your feet? or more towards the insides. And by the way, are you more on one foot than the other foot? Or is your weight equally distributed? How straight are your knees? If I didn't ask you to stop in two minutes, but instead I asked you to power pose for the next two hours, what part of you would be the most relieved that it was over? Consider your breath. As you inhale and exhale, what parts of you move? Does your belly expand and contract? Or is it doing something else as it power poses? What about your chest? If your chest is moving with your inhale and exhale, does it move out to the sides? Does it move forward and back? What do you notice about the width of your chest? What about your shoulder blades? Can you feel how your shoulder blades are resting on your back? If I had a plumb line and I dropped it down the center of your forehead, out the end of your nose and down to the floor, where would it land? And then let it go. Just stand again. For the folks at home, we can see if we can detect any difference. And now, Cynthia, can you once again think about that dispiriting thing, that task that maybe you have ahead of you? Is your sense of it, your experience of thinking about it, or your attitude toward it changed at all from just standing in the power pose?